Hello everyone. Well, a little while ago, I made a video using this atlas and I stopped at this point and talked about doing the rest of it in another video. So I think that's what I'll do today. I'm going to put a link up on the screen to the first video if you'd like to see all of the parts of the atlas back here. But today we're going to start here and move forward. So this part of the atlas talks about each of the individual states and Puerto Rico. And it goes by alphabetical order, so it starts with Alabama. And you'll see here it has a map of the state and then little icons or logos all across the state that denote what is the crop or the industry that is primarily grown or manufactured in that part of the state. So Alabama here looks pretty diverse and this atlas was made in I believe it was 1969. So at that time these are the things that were being grown or produced in the state. We have um, cement and coal, strawberries, watermelon, and peaches. It says water power here. There must be a dam there across that river. Textiles, sugar cane, clothing, oil, aluminum, paper, cabbages, turpentine, Sawmilling. There's quite a few sawmills here, 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 here. It's the, um, probably along this river, and along this river is why the sawmills are there. So it features here a cotton picker dumping some cotton into a truck or something. Then we have Alaska. Um, not a whole lot on Alaska, interestingly enough. Here they show oil at the top, gold, tin and tungsten, platinum, fish, vegetables, copper, and molybdenum. I haven't heard of that before. So, lots of minerals being mined in Alaska at this time, and still even to today. Canning. It's really interesting you don't think about some of those things being important to the economy of a state. We have Arizona, which is very different. This is cold <laughs> up near the Arctic Circle in the Arctic Ocean state. And Arizona is very hot and dry and um, a lot of desert in Arizona and a lot of mining. We have more copper and molybdenum, copper, manganese, gold and silver, lead and zinc, asbestos. Oh, that's interesting. They probably don't do that so much anymore. We also have cattle, watermelons, peaches, sheep, sawmilling, and vacation resorts. We have Arkansas here. It's along the Mississippi River, all along this border here. Lots of sawmills. Cow peas, strawberries, melons, tomatoes, string beans, grapes, furniture, that's interesting, more aluminum, mercury, cotton, natural gas, and oil, rice, hay, and mules. And shoes 
are made up here in this area at that time. Very interesting. Then we have California. In California we have, let's see, figs, walnuts, asparagus, shipbuilding, wine, almonds, olives, very neat, potatoes, and down here it says motion pictures. <laughs> seashore resorts, airplanes, and flax. And then we have Colorado. Lots of mining right in this area. Huge amount. Let's see what else they have. Apples, sugar beets, mountain resorts, marble. That makes sense, being near the mountains forests, iron and steel, broom corn, sorghum, onions, vegetables, very interesting, sugar beets, sugar beets, sugar beets, and then sugar refining, so I'm sure those are related to each other. Connecticut, we have, um, here's one that says clocks, hardware, guns, potatoes, sweet corn, woolen textiles, machinery, shipbuilding, electrical equipment, and down here in the corner it says vacuum cleaners. <laughs> That's funny. Delaware, we have leather up here, automobiles. Wonder um, what factory that was that made automobiles in Delaware. That'd be interesting to find out. Cucumbers, pumpkins, lima beans. And here we have Florida. Shellfish here, here, and here. Fertilizer. Tug nuts. I have no idea. Tongue. T U N G N U T S. I have never heard of those. They're here and here. Cigars sponges, celery, avocados, grapefruits, oranges, persimmons, very cool. Here we have Georgia, let's see, sweet potatoes, tobacco, turnips, peanuts, more asparagus, furniture and automobiles near um, Atlanta, cement, construction machinery, bricks, cow peas, more sugar refining, canning. Lots of canning is on the shoreline. It's very interesting. And here we have Hawaii. Pineapples, sugar cane, fish, coffee. And this here says S-I-S-A-L. Sisal? I don't know what that is either. And here we have Illinois. Cheese, lake resorts, meat packing, 
radio and television, clocks, farm machinery, explosives, paint, oil refining, shoes, soybeans, pottery, railroad equipment, glass, coal, very cool, Idaho, mining in this area, and a lot of mining through here, lettuce, sheep, cattle, potatoes, plums, sugar beets, wheat, beans, cheese, honey, that's a new one, and the atomic industry near Idaho Falls and near Arco. And this says this is the Craters of the Moon National Monument. Then we have Indiana. Let's see what we have here. Heating equipment, rye, musical instruments, rubber goods, onions, radio and television, oats, vegetables in general, soybean, more heating equipment, printing, let's see, refrigerators, poultry, furniture, tobacco, horses, Iowa, grapes, potatoes, butter, lake resorts, printing, pens like you write with, very interesting, railroad, railroad equipment, corn products, tractors, Instruments has a little um, microscope there. Kansas. Kansas has got a lot of stuff, but a lot of wheat, barley, barley, wheat, barley. You can tell there's a lot of farming of grains in this area. Broom corn. Getting over here closer to this part of the state. We have printing and flour, railroad equipment, soap, automobiles and parts. And this says clay. You don't often think of clay being something that you mine out of the ground, but I guess you do. And here we have Kentucky. Tobacco products, the atomic industry over here on this side, tobacco, horses. Horses are big around Lexington. I used to live in this state, so. And tobacco. We lived way out in the country at one point in time, and my dad worked bringing tobacco into the barns to be dried. Um, electrical equipment, liquor. I remember driving through some area of Kentucky where they made whiskey, and it always smelled like really nice baked potatoes that had just come out of the oven. Um, it was a really nice smell. Bricks, iron and steel, clocks. Then we have Louisiana. Along the coast we have shellfish. Oil refining here along the Mississippi. 
sugar refining, sawmills, cattle, oil, cotton, paper, beans, sweet potatoes, hay, salt. There's a new one. We haven't seen salt before. Then we go to Maine. Shipbuilding, furniture, toys. Here you mine feldspar. And here you mine sand. Interesting. Canning, machinery, clothing, berries, very general, berries. I wonder if they mean um, cranberries. Sawmilling, way up in here. Lots of forests, peas and potatoes. Maryland, let's see what we can find here. Liquor, smelting and refining, musical instruments, Maple syrup, there we go. Asparagus, textiles, and this is granite being mined out of the ground. And Massachusetts. Plastics, leather, wire, shoes, candy, that's a new one. Silverware, jewelry, optical goods, metal products, marble. Oh, here's cranberries. So these berries over here must be different than cranberries. Michigan. Cereals, cement, automobile and parts, natural gas, chemicals, salt, cherries. It's interesting. Drugs, <laughs> there's where they all come from. Now we know. Tires, butter, Lots of sawmills up in here. Potatoes, copper, fish, iron ore. And here we have Minnesota. Oats, wheat, sawmills and paper all along this area. Paper, paper, rye, Farm machines and clothing, poultry, hogs, cattle, more oats, flax, lots of oats, butter and cheese, onions, a lot of agriculture down here and up through this area, and then mining up in the north, and in Mississippi. Lots of forests here, cotton up through here, pottery, horses, tomatoes, oil, cabbage, tires, peppers. Missouri, more cotton, Grapes, animal feeds, mules, cereals, popcorn, way up here. That's a new one. Rubber goods, chemicals, beer. Very nice. Montana. Lots of mining all through here. Gypsum, gold, 
phosphate and copper, antimony, gypsum, stone, just regular old stone, hay, cattle, coal. Those are really big in this state. Nebraska, lots of cattle, dairy, wheat, and corn. Part of the breadbasket of this country for sure. And Nevada, tons of mining, all different types of things. And then we have some livestock, sheep and cattle scattered throughout. Lake resorts down here. New Hampshire, lots of sawmills, paper, paper, sawmills, dairying, metal products, printing, cigars made in New Hampshire, interesting, apples, leather, apples and mining, and then forest all up through there. More cranberries. Sweet corn. This is interesting. You have this whole part is all food products mostly and growing cucumbers and tomatoes and lima beans and then the canning industry that preserves all of that. But then you get up into here in New Jersey and you get much more the industry of beer and clothing and textiles, instruments, television, right, it's concentrated in that area. Here we have New Mexico. Let's see, the atomic industry near Los Alamos. Helium, cattle right here, lead and zinc, and gold and silver. This is pretty much exclusively mining with smelting next to Silver City, so a properly named city. Peppers, sugar beets, marble, oil, oil refining, peanuts, molybdenum again, Mica. So, and then we have New York. Lots of stuff going on here. Grapes, furniture, airplanes, optical goods, potatoes, maple syrup, salt, beets, business machines. Shoes, radio and television, cameras, paper and dairy and maple syrup, iron ore, leather products, cement, apples and onions and stone, more drugs, radio and television again, shipbuilding, airplanes, potatoes, and vegetables. And here we have North Carolina. Sawmilling, water power, guns, cigarettes, cigarettes, tobacco, peanuts, hosiery, shellfish, Soybeans, more paper, strawberries, lots of shellfish along the area, um, coast area. Here we have North Dakota, lots of wheat, barley, grains here, cattle, dairy, sheep, 
potatoes. In Ohio, we have salt, popcorn, onions, vegetables, the atomic industry, beans, natural gas, pottery and dishes, iron and steel, maple syrup, rubber goods, washing machines, automobiles, shipyards. In Oklahoma, we have sorghum, wheat, pecans, peanuts, forests, glass, airplanes, metal products, spinach, there's a new one. Oregon. Looks like everything in Oregon is over on the side of the state. Not a whole lot going on there. Have plums, seed peas, cheese, walnuts, hops. There's a new one. Hops here. Pears, mercury, cattle and sheep. Pennsylvania, we have wire, hosiery, vegetables, drugs, railroad, clothing, leather, bricks, and a little Rhode Island over here. Poultry, dairy, poultry, dairy, chemicals and wire, machinery, silverware. South Carolina, we have peanuts down here, cucumbers and melons, the atomic industry here on the Savannah River, asparagus, more hosiery, water power, brass, sweet potatoes, shipbuilding, cigars, and South Dakota. Again, you can tell we're in the, the Midwest, in the West. We have mining predominantly here, and then just a massive amount of grains being grown and cattle and sheep and horses. Amazing. Well, I think I'm going to pause here and split this video up into two different sections. So I will continue the rest of this book in the next video that I post. Okay. So thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my channel, and I will be making many more videos for you all. Thanks. Bye.